<laughs> but yeah, next question. Fucking, no, how is that a question? There's a story behind that because fucking I moved to Melbourne. Yeah, basically, me and Joel have always played in bands together. We moved to Canberra, met Benny. Uh, we moved down to Melbourne. Like we're sitting around playing no music for like 12 months. We're like, we should start like a rock and roll band. Make me a fucking bad moves to Melbourne, man. And I'm like, hey, do you want to start like a pretty heavy rock and roll band? And he's like, yeah, man, let's do it. So then, um, we'd fucking start this rock and roll band, but we to get on the internet and look for someone who's a singer. None of us are from Melbourne, so we didn't know anybody. Ninja pops his head up, comes and has a jam, and it just got heavier and heavier, basically. And now we're playing like doom metal. Like, like, we were all like in the doom metal beforehand, we just came back to like our roots kind of. Secret or we'll hand this one over to Nico. Mission! Or we'll hand this one over to Nico. Right. Mission is a bit too, uh, too much. But basically, the bunch of Jehovah's Witnesses walked up in my house one day, had a chat with them, and they gave me the Watchtower magazine, um, which is the Jehovah's Witness. Own church magazine, and I thought this band needs to be named Watchdown. <laughs> well, fuck, thanks, man. That's um, I don't know. What was the question again? <laughs> oh, well, the demo arrives a bit of a long story, basically, but we fucking wrote these three songs in like two seconds and we're like, shit, we should record this. Two songs in the first jam. Yeah, yeah, two first songs. Two of the songs are from the first jam, and they're one and two. And I didn't even have my rig at the first jam. Yeah. <laughs> and then we wrote these songs, and we're like, fuck, we should record. So we got over this mate of ours, Babe, who, you know, like smoke pipes and recorded shit in his garage. And we went out there for the weekend and crashed in his garage and just recorded, recorded the three songs, basically. Yeah. And then, and then, that was done in like February and there was like all this fucking drama surrounding the demo, man. Um, you know, like tapes that wanted to put us out and, you know, like everything took for ages. And yeah, we ended up just releasing it in November because we were just like so sick of it. And we'd written like absenteeism and all that stuff was already written. So we're like, we just have to get this out because we got like new, better stuff to put out. Yeah, we, we got picked up by this dude who can sound for us and he was like, come and fucking have a day in my studio for free. And we recorded it live, I've done it like six or seven tapes. Now we have a hard on sound. No, yeah, that sounded yeah. out of it as well. Anthony's so, in that. Mm -hmm. Shout out to Anthony. Anthony did it out. Uh, and now, yeah, we've had that out for like a week. And it's going really well for us so far. But look, we're really stoked. It seems like a lot more people from overseas like this. Lots of people in Russia, Russia and Poland. We're, and we're basing that off sort of, I guess, the reception we've had here, yeah? Like, which yeah. hasn't really been amazing, but like, having people come up after we play and be like, that's cool. I mean, that's, 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 that's sick, that's not all we can really ask for. Yeah. Well, it's weird, because there's some good bands getting around, you know? Mm. And we're about to play this really cool show that's all really like good Doom and Sludge band, so it's, it's good, but it's, it's not really, there's not really too many, like it's not that, it's, yeah, like it's good, but it's not as big as, you know, like where it might be somewhere else in the world. Yeah. Well, it's got a fucking we we got, we got some, we got some fucking we definitely the same bands. bands pop up. Yeah. yeah, you see a lot of the same bands You see like, sort of basket, like you've got like White Horse and Sumo stuff like that and they're all fucking really sick bands so yeah absolutely we're we'll playing with Subaru in April so that'll be sick yeah yeah, yeah we're in the Subaru the house show with Raw yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. the house yeah. show with Raw yeah. and God Gods and shit that was fucking wild man. Yeah. because we put Turned all the lights out in the living room and put candles on our heads. It was in a basement of like a dodgy suburb in Melbourne as well. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it was bizarre. And then shout outs to Jimmy Mack for letting yeah, us play. Yeah, Jimmy let us play. Head. And we got to smoke weed and play, and the whole room was yeah. just 
filled with smoke and there was a yeah. she disco light. Like, yeah, and Pops came. Yeah, 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 Pops came. Yeah, that was sick. That was yeah. fucking best show. That's probably one of the best shows I've ever played. Yeah, so yeah, much fun. Man, it was really cool. Oh, oh we got a heap we of shows. Been, we've been talking about that tonight. We've got a heap of shows coming up in uh, in April. Like we just landed. Uh, well, I'm not going to say that because it's not Ooh. announced yet. But we've landed a heap of heaps of big shows like coming up in April and stuff, which is going to get us a lot of exposure. Pretty much nothing that's been announced yet. Yeah. 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 But it's cool so yeah, it's definitely really, some bigger shows definitely yeah. for us anyway. Yeah. yeah. Watch out for us then. And. Um, <laughs> And, and 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 do like an EP, do an EP, like hopefully. do it, do another, do another recording, and yeah, definitely have another release tomorrow. this year. That'll be out in final. Yeah, we're going into we're going into state in a couple months. Try and go into state. Just be able to hang out and you know, fucking get this with the boys in the garage, man. Just have a good time. Mm.